Hi everyone, Ron Farrell 73 here, and this is a video on uh, my uh, favorite uh, Arrow video releases. And uh, these are in no particular order. First up, this is uh, Beyond the Door, and uh, this is a two disc set. This has uh, both versions of the movie. Um, one with the uh, US title Beyond the Door and one with the uh, other title I can't remember the name of and it's got a whole lot of bonus features and there's some I think there's some from the Code Red Blu-ray release and it comes with a uh, booklet it comes with a book and uh, I'm pretty sure this edition's limited Deadbeat at Dawn, and uh, this is a two-disc set, and uh, this is a really good uh, revenge movie from Jim Van Beber, and it's got some new bonus features on it, and some music videos, and uh, I think, yeah, some of the features from uh, the Dark Sky release, and this blows away the uh, Dark Sky release um, out of the water. And it has a new documentary uh, in it, and um, one of the pe <coughs> there's uh, <coughs> an interview with uh, one of our one one former YouTuber. I don't know if he's still on here or not, or if his channel's still on here. Uh, known as uh, Eight the Chosen One. I'm sure you all remember him. The mutilator and I'm glad Aero Video put this out and I had a, a DVD on demand copy of this uh, several years ago but I got rid of it when uh, this came out and this is a really good decent slasher movie Driller Killer and uh, this is another good uh, slasher movie I think this came out in like 79 and this is on the uh, Mill Creek uh, Chilling Classics uh, 50 movie a DVD set that I have and I uh, had a uh, standard alone DVD of this at one time and then uh, Arrow Video put this out so I decided to get this and uh, get rid of that other DVD anyway. Um, this is um, more along the lines of Taxi Driver and Maniac. This is a uh, box set, and I figured I'd go ahead and get this uh, before it goes out, if it ever did go out of print. And this is the Herschel G. This is the Herschel Gordon Lewis feast, and this is uh, <coughs> a two uh, uh, six DVD, uh, six Blu-ray set of his movies, and there's two movies on uh, one DVD, and uh, I mean one Blu-ray, and uh, this uh, third uh, Blu-ray set has uh, three movies on one DVD, and it's got the classics, Blood Feast, 2000 Maniacs, Wizard of Gore, and some others that are pretty uh, campy and cheesy, but decent. Basket Case, and this is one of my favorites from the 80s, and this is classic monster movie goodness and uh, it's got some new bonus features in it uh, that are and I'm sure it's got I think it's got some of the bonus features from the something weird uh, edition that I had and uh, never really cared much for two and three I mean this is pretty much a standalone for me This is the uh, steel book of an American werewolf in London, and I'm sure this is pretty much limited, and the uh, artwork for this is pretty good, and uh, this is definitely a uh, favorite from the 80s, along with The Howling, and this came out in 81, along with uh, The Howling and Wolfen. And uh, I think this is a limited edition, and... Uh, this is Wes Craven's Last House on the Left, and uh, comes with a uh, book and uh, some other stuff, I think a poster, and uh, this is a three-disc set, comes with the uh, with 
some of it has limited edition contents and uh, disc one is the uncut version of the blu-ray while disc two is the cut of Krug and company and R-rated cuts and it comes with a uh, CD soundtrack and uh, there's also a steel book of this uh, with the uh, cover art from the uh, VHS Vestron release that came out in the 80s Creepshow 2 and I just had to upgrade this from the Anchor Bay uh, edition that I had and uh, this is a pretty entertaining uh, sequel I mean my favorites are the raft and uh, the uh, hitchhiker and uh, I like Tom Savini's performance as the creeper and this is out of print um, but uh, the movies here are uh, pretty much uh, available separately and this is uh, George A. Romero between night and dawn and uh, these are uh, the films that he made uh, after uh, Night of the Living Dead and uh, sadly Martin's not on here I mean hopefully maybe one of these days we can see a US release of that on Blu-ray and it comes with the movies um, there's always vanilla I watched one time when I had the Anchor Bay uh, blue uh, DVD of season of the witch and uh, just didn't really think much of it I mean I may watch it again just for the hell of it season of the witch is pretty much a good drama and some people might be bored with it but I think it's entertaining and the crazies is a classic and it comes with a book also and uh, if you can find this uh, really cheap somewhere pick it up that's uh, all I have here and uh, hope everyone uh, has enjoyed uh, this summer so far. Uh, if you want to sub to me, feel free. Until then, this is Ron here saying take care and see ya.